Brad Green, Hi, Martin Howie. Guitar. How are you? Great, man. Good to see you. Good to see you, too. Uh, it's been an exciting couple years for Martin, of course. Busy, busy. Busy, busy, yes. And possibly for some of us out there, one of the more exciting things that we've seen come about is a special anniversary from the OMJM. Yep. Uh, so first of all, I just, I, you know, there's some obvious things I want to ask questions about, but okay. can just let us in, give us some insight in how the development process for something like this happens with sure. someone like John Mayer. Yeah, well, obviously we've, we've been working with John for 20 years, hence the name. Right. That's pretty obvious. Um, I've been working with John probably over the last five years, one on one on whatever projects or models that he wants to do. So we brought the idea up, hey, we'd like to do a 20th anniversary model with him. And of course, he was absolutely down for it. But he really wanted to do something unique, something special. And John gets very involved in the projects. I mean, these are his ideas. This is the way he wants the guitar to look. And, you know, we get on the phone together and we just start pitching stuff back and forth. And he always has some great stuff to add in there. And this is what we ended up with. And yep. Platinum Gray Burst is a really difficult color yes. yeah. to photograph. And yeah. John and I even talked about that. He was like, Man, it just doesn't come across in the photograph the same way it does in person. And so you got to kind of play with it. But when you see it in person, it looks way better. It is stunning. Yeah. Can, can you talk a little bit about how you arrived at that finish, the, the, the Platinum, yeah, absolutely. platinum Gray Burst, right? Yeah, Platinum okay. Gray Burst. Okay. Uh, John had sent a picture of, an old, of a guitar that had an old piece of wood on top. He says, can you kind of match this color? We're trying to work with it. And that was really an old stained piece of wood. And we just started going back and forth, back and forth. And we're sending him samples. So we'd make sample colors. And I would send them in the mail. And he would send them back and say, I kind of like this, more of this, less of that. Until we kind of zoomed in on it. He had mentioned at one time it really reminds him of when they do movies. And they would shoot a nighttime scene, but they shoot it in the day. And then they go back and they would colorize the film to make it okay. look like nighttime. He says that's what it wanted. It reminded him of that. And that was sort of the look he was going for. It's 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 very it's quintessential John Mayer de description. Like yes. I don't know, if there's anybody He's better at, at being able to articulate something like that. Yeah, yeah. So, it, so it comes across really now. Smart. Now, obviously, there's two different versions. Right. Um, this one sort of carries on the, the traditional the, OMJM the, the torch from yep. the OMJM. Exactly. Pretty much just taking the color uh, and just adding that in as a sort of twenty. And John, that was really John's idea. He says, "I don't want to just do a, a high end piece. I want to do a piece that." more people can get a hold of. So let's just do the color on, on the standard OMJM. Yeah. So he really insisted on that so more consumers could get into it. And, of course, the original is still available? The original is still available, the 45 style, which yeah. has all the crazy stuff on it, all yeah. the inlaid silver and the pit guard inlaid in the top, uh, inlaid silver on the bridge, up the neck. It has the rosette that follows through on the neck, which is a lot of work. I can imagine. Guatemalan rosewood back and sides. Uh, once again, more silver going all over the top of it. Uh, yeah, it's really, really tough. Cool cool inlays where it actually has their border to Mother of Pearl with abalone on the inlays. Wow. There's just so much stuff going on, and it sounds fantastic. Yes, yeah. Yeah, and it looks great on stage when John's playing it. I've seen it. It does. Yeah. It does, yeah. And so, and then the original original is still available as well, right? Yes, the that's right. OMJM. You, you can get the regular OMJM, right. no color if you want it that way. Okay. Uh, no upcharge for this color. Oh, so, oh Same wow. price as a regular OMJM. Okay. Amazing. Yeah. yeah so if we you're thinking about getting one, that, I mean, I don't know if you need a better reason than that. But no, because we're, these are <laughs> only know. available. You can order these through August this year. Okay. And then that's it. They're okay. done, and we're not taking any more orders. So whatever is built at that point, is we're done. That's it. Well, this is Collectible. special. It's special. And Thank you. here's to another 20 I you hope know, with so. John Mayer and, yeah, he's and a great uh, guy. another 190 with Martin, right? 190, that, yes. I did the math right. Okay. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, Fred, I really appreciate you, it, Tom. man. Thank you so My much pleasure. for the time. And we'll talk again soon, I'm sure. Thank you, sir. All right. Thanks, Bye -bye. brother.